Hello my dear friends, welcome back to English Easy Learn. I am your Arpud Raj. Today we are going to learn about noun numbers. We have discussed about all the kinds of nouns. So in this topic, in this video, we are going to discuss about noun number. Number, what is this number? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5? It's a number, yes. So that also comes under this topic. Please pay attention. You can understand just this video is enough to make you clear what is this noun number. When you go to the noun number, it is divided into two. That is a singular and plural. Singular and plural. Singular is nothing but when you talk about only one. Only one. It's maybe a one pen or one group. So anyway, it is what it talks about singular that is only one one more than one even from two onwards two or more two or more are called plurals you get me it's a very simple and very easy concept in english language that is a singular singular and plural singular is only one more than one is plural you get it but here comes when we are going through the spelling rules for this singular and plural is the complicated. It starts from very simple to and tougher part. So please pay attention. See one by one. So you will be understand very clear. Very clear. I will be uh, able to give you this for each and every single rule. Some of the example words. So that will make you clear and understanding about the singular and plural. Yes? Come let us see. Most of the nouns in English language just adding yes they become plural. Just yes alone if you add they become plural. For example pen. When we have pen just if you add yes that becomes plural. When you have a table just if you add yes tables so that becomes plural yes it's understood so when you take some more example tree if you add yes it becomes plural we will also take some more example student so we add just yes students just adding yes they become plurals you see just pen pens table tables tree trees and students students just adding of yes that becomes plural this is the rule number one for making singular and plural clear let us move on to the rule number two the second rule talks about just which are the singulars they are ending in yes yes z and ch if they are ending in this singulars when we add es they become plurals for examples pass passes bus buses and palace palaces so it's already it's ending in e we are just yes palace bush so it is ending in sh as i have said so sh also i think i left so sh also so bush bushes so we add es bushes and dish dishes so they become plural is it clear okay next some are there we will see next the examples so you see once again pass passes bus buses palace palace bush bushes dish dishes there is also one more when it is ending in x also we add es to make plural for example box boxes fox foxes so if you are very clear with this singular and plural rules while writing we will not have difficulty in the spelling rules spelling mistakes we will not make if you are thorough with this singular and plural this same thing goes with the um, verb also verbs also that we will see one by one so okay next we will go to the next the third rule 
So here do you see the next third one. So we are going to the next slowly to the difficult part. So ending in IES. Sorry. Adding. Adding IES. When do we add IES? When the singulars are ending in Y. When the singulars are ending in Y. Next thing, minutely observe. Followed by a consonant. You see, the Y is following the consonant. It is following the consonant. It is following the consonant. If the Y follows a consonant, then we add IES. Look at how do we add IES. It is a babies. Yes, we are adding IES. Babies, ladies, puppies, and skies. Is it clear? It is very clearly you have to look at. It is when the Y is following the consonant. Not simply adding by looking at the Y adding IES. It will become a wrong. Next I will tell you the exceptionals. Why we should not add. So when it is following a consonant. Then we add IES. You see here. It is a consonant. It is a consonant. It is a consonant. So if the Y is following this consonant. So we add IES to make plural. Clear? See the next exceptionals. Look at this rule. Adding yes. Same thing. It is also ending in Y. Ending in Y followed by vowel. See here. This Y. These are also ending in Y. As previously I said. And they are following vowel. A, E, I, O, U are the vowels. So here this Y are following the vowel. So what we do is just add yes to make plural. Look at here. Boys. That's it. No IES. And rays. And monkeys. Monkeys. So when we look at this word ending in YES. Whether IS or IES. That confusion happens. So if we are clear with this spelling rule will not be a problem, will not be an issue, there will not be any confusion. You see here, so they are ending in Y, but they are following the vowel. So Y, it's following vowel, so just yes. Y following A, that is vowel, just yes. Y, it is just following E, it is a vowel, so monkeys. Clear? Good. Let us move on to the next rule. Here you look at, it is the adding es it is the rule number four adding es where do we add es already we have seen but it has some of the exceptionals so i have separated it so ending in wo if the singular noun ends in wo we add es for example hero heroes and potato potatoes tomato tomatoes And echo echoes. So they are ending in wo. Ending in wo, we add just es to make plural. It also has exceptional where we add just yes. Exceptionals, there is no rules behind, but we have to understand it. For example, when we say photo, photo, it's just photos. It's just photo, video, videos. So there is no special or specified rules behind. So when it is ending in O also, we have to add just yes. These are just some of the words we have to understand and we have to know it and we have to keep in our mind. So that is the exceptional just we add yes even though they are ending in O. Clear? Let us move on to the next rule. Here look at the fifth one, adding V-E-S. V-E-S, where do we add? 
singular nouns which are ending in f r f e f r f e if they are ending in f r f e we add that is v e s and we make plural you see half what we do is h a l v e s house so what we do we remove this f house next knife k n i v e s so knives we what we do is we remove completely this and next wife w i v e s so we remove f e from wife and from life l i v e s we add and we remove this so half house knife knives wife wives life lives so this is the spelling rule we will not make mistakes if you are very clear if they are just adding v e s where if they are ending in f and f e so while changing we cut off this we remove this we remove we remove don't just we add uh, half v e s no it is we remove that f and we add v e s to make plural clear good we'll move on to the next but however here also some exceptional we have in this rule also even though it is ending in f and f e we add just s to make plural you see cliff cliffs cliffs and believe believes handkerchief handkerchiefs so just we add s to make plural even though they are ending in f or e f clear yes let us move on to the next rule here you look at the another rule it is very simple change the vowel if we change the vowel they become the plural for example foot feet and goose geese man men man men woman we mean just changing the vowel and they become the plural so this is a very simple to understand how it comes there is certain things we have to keep in our mind so we will not forget that here are some of the peculiar singular and plural rules are here you see don't change they remain always singular and plural same deer sheep fish they don't change always remain singular or plural it is used according to the context we change our other verb parts but they remain same and next always looks like a plural we use singular and plural same no change scissors so scissors because it has a two parts with one part we cannot cut so scissors binoculars also it is not singular it is both binoculars pants nobody wears only one side and goes it is both the side so pants they always go in plural next always used in singular they are used always in singular they don't have the plural forms for example news is we don't say news is only we say news there is no news is what are the news is in the city nobody so it is a news politics no politic politics and uh, billiards so they always go in singular they are not used in the plural cannot be used also clear i hope you understood this singular and plural if you do not understand once watch it twice you will not forget in your life so by knowing some of the examples whatever i have given so you try to use what are the nouns you come across in your books while reading and try to apply these rules around nine rules i have said so these rules if you apply you will not make mistakes you yourself try and practice it so for each rule five or 10 more nouns that will not be forgotten in your life thank you for watching we will meet in the next video bye bye take care